Hey y'all, I just thought that I would do my first video, hashtag walk away. It's about time, it's time we walk away. It's time that we no longer allow anybody to try to hurt us. Democratic Party is the party of slavery, Jim Crow. It's the party that actually destroyed Black Wall Street. It's the party that, that has done nothing but destroy and divide the country. I don't know why everyone doesn't see what they're actually doing. All of the falsehoods, whether you're a Trump supporter or not, you need to actually look in the mirror and look outside and see what's really going on because there's a lot of lies going on in this area, in this country. It's time for a better way. Stop letting, I hate the Democratic Party. How dare you tell us that we need you? How dare you tell us that we can't achieve anything without you? How can you say that? How can you do that to somebody? For generations upon generations and now we actually think that we need you and we don't. Black people are the strongest people. We run faster, we jump higher. No sickness has ever, ever taken us out. And it's time for us to do what we're supposed to do. I promise you, it's time. I'm leaving, I've been left. It's time for y'all to leave because we're intelligent. We deserve the world. We don't need anybody to tell us that we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Whoever told you that you were never, were, were never meant to be anything, you're black, so you have to be in the same place, in the same space. You'll never go anywhere because there's always this invisible white man that's bothering you, that's going to stop you from achieving. The people who tell you that are the people who have money and no white man ever stood in their way. That's something that you got to understand. You got to know that now. We are the greatest, in my opinion. I'm proud of us, and we can do whatever we want to do. We created Black Wall Street. We were the most, we were so intelligent. We, we built up so much wealth for our community, and I think we can do it again. I think we can. And if nobody, if no one is in, has our back, is in our corner, then we need to work harder and work together so that we can get out of it. This whole idea that we'll never achieve anything, that we'll never be anything, it's, we're pets to them. We're pets to the Democratic Party. They only use us. They don't care about what we, anything. They don't care about anything that we actually want. You keep voting for Maxine Waters. Have you seen the neighborhood she owns, the district? I don't understand. I don't get it. Don't get me wrong. It's a lot of racists in this country. It's a lot of racists in the world, even. But just because racism will never be over, that doesn't mean that we should stop and give up and let other people tell us how we're supposed to live. We have people that are trying their hardest and they are struggling. But when you're in a poverty trap like Section 8 or HUD, it's almost impossible to get out. And it needs to be reformed. And I know the party that could reform it because the party that everybody keeps saying is the party of civil rights is the party of redlining is the party of lynching. The Democratic Party, 70% of them voted against the civil rights, the civil rights movement of the 60s. 70% of them voted against it. The Republican Party is the party that actually voted for it. Yeah. Civil rights was actually supposed to be passed during your Ulysses S. Grant's time. Um, but after Abe died and Andrew Johnson became president, he was a racist Democrat and he got rid of it. Something you need to know, you got to do some research because I've been doing a lot of studying on the topic. And, um, 
it's just time for us to leave. It's time to wake up and it's time to make something different. Trying to time to make something change. I believe that with all of my heart. It's time to walk away. It's time to walk away.